Part two. Cleaning it out. Washing it to get the blood out of it. You rub it good, make sure they ain't got a bunch of hairs on it. Uh, if you find a bloodshot place like it, that's where the point of the bullet come out. You split it. And then when you soak it in salt, the salt will go in there and dissolve the blood. You soak your wild meat that's been shot in salt water. For deer meat, you want to put a little bit of uh, sodium it helps draw out the blood and the wild taste. Uh, now I run cold water. Always use cold water on your game. Never hot. Use cold water. Run some water on it. And then we'll get some salt. And what is the purpose of the cold water? Go water dissolves blood. Dissolves blood. Yeah. And the salt takes out that funny flavor. The salt helps draw the blood out. Oh, it helps draw the salt blood. and cold water. Turn it up. Get that salt to dissolve. Now, he's ready to soak. Now, if. Uh, I have skipped the soaking spot when I go out hunting. An old hunter, he likes his meat fresh. Right. You go out and kill them, come in, clean them, and cook them right in. You don't worry about no soaking. You just wash them off. Then you eat them. So always wash your knife. But we got we got to mow some yards today. Yeah. So we ain't got no time to pick up a squirrel quite right. at this moment. All right, boys, that's how you skin a squirrel, and that's a lesson from Mr. Dole Harrison here, and uh, I tell you, he's a good man. This is a really good man. He invited me in his home, and he's sharing everything with me, and uh, open heartedness, and God led me to him, amen. Thank you so much, and I hope you're having a wonderful day. God bless you. God bless America.